Hey everyone, welcome to Quarantine Cooking. Here at the Arbor Inn we have a mulberry tree, so today we're going to make some mulberry cake. Don't fret, if you don't have mulberries, you can still use blackberries and blueberries and raspberries. We're also going to make today's dish vegan. So instead of eggs, we're going to use two bananas and we're also going to use some vegan butter. Now, hold on, before we get started, we got to do a couple prep steps first. Number one, go wash your hands. I don't want any of that bacteria getting in here. Number two, you're going to want to preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And number three, you're going to want to butter your pan. Does that sound good? Alright, let's get to making this cake. We're going to get started on making the batter. First, we're going to take our bananas and we're going to mash them up real well. Once we got the bananas mashed up into a soft consistency, we can start adding in the sugar. So for the sugar, we're only going to do three-fourths of a cup of sugar. If you want to go less, go for it. The mulberries are going to be pretty sweet themselves, but uh, I'm a real sweet tooth, so we're going to do three-fourths cup of sugar. We're going to slowly put in a couple dashes of vanilla extract. That vanilla extract, it's really going to give it just a sweet kind of vibe. We're going to slowly start to whisk it. All right, we're going to get it soft, and then we're slowly going to start adding more and more uh, flour. And as you can see here now, it's getting more goopy, kind of like that. We're going to start putting in the baking powder. The baking powder is really important because it's a rising agent. So the baking powder is only going to be one teaspoon. Once you have all those ingredients going, then you're going to pour a thin layer in your pan. And then we're going to add a thin layer of jam. Now this is mulberry jam, however, you can use any kind of jam you want. Once you add the mulberry jam on top of that layer of batter, you're going to add another layer of batter, and then you're going to add your mulberries, and then another layer. And once that's done, you're going to put it in the oven, put a timer on for 45 to 55 minutes, and then when you take it out, you're going to want to stick a knife right in the center, and if the knife comes out clean, then it's time to eat. You know, I think I put in too much jam. <laughs> no such thing. Solid, not out of time. Oh my god. Like, yeah, just like, give it like the perfect sourness. Look how the sweet of the banana mm -hmm. the Yeah, it's very tart. No, okay. Rachel, what are you doing? I'm washing this damn mess you guys made. We're also gray watering, so we're gonna take some of the water. So we're wash the cleanest dishes first, and we're gonna pour that water into the dirtier dishes so that we can use the least amount of water and care the most about the planet. <laughs> 